Hello, and welcome to this tutorial about exam management in the cloud. If you're a teacher, a student, or even a school manager, you will definitely benefit from this great site where you can create online lessons, mentor students, prepare exams, and much more. In today's tutorial, we're going to talk in a teacher perspective about the creation of an exam using our platform. So let's get started. In your private dashboard, just select the test tab and tests category. Here, a new page will open where you can add new tests with various selections, English spelling, French, math, etc. Now, go to the add new button. We will now be able to create a traditional exam sheet using the form. First, type the name for the test and then select a test category. Now, give a brief description of the test. You can also specify the maximum time limit for this question and the number of questions. Another feature is to add some graphics to the test. You can upload your own if you like. When finished, click the update button. Until now, we've created a test category. Now, we will need to populate the questions. Click on the Edit Questions button, followed by the Add Question option. Here, you can select various question types, such as descriptive, multiple choice, math, etc. First, we're going to add a descriptive question. Type your question in this field and add any extra information regarding the question. Finally, choose a question group. Let's add another question called fill in the blanks. Again, add info that describes what we need to do to answer the question. The other steps are the same as previous. We'll now try the multiple choice question. Here, we can add any number of choices that will appear to the students so they can choose from one. Another nice feature is the spelling out question. It's simply a text-to-speech based question where the student has to listen to the question and write the corresponding answer. We have the computer marked text answers. Put a description and choose whether the answer will be case sensitive or not. Type the correct answer that needs to be provided and don't forget the marks as well. A useful extension exists called Computer Marked Multiple Text Answers. It's basically the same concept but with multiple answers that each provide a mark. Finally, we have the math computer marked question. This question, as its name, is a math question. It can be a formula where we need to find the unknown x. I'm going to show you an example. Don't forget to type the correct answer. Once finished, you'll still be able to manage your questions, add more, edit the existing ones, or delete undesired questions. We've now come to the end of this tutorial. I hope this has been helpful, and if you still have questions, please check out our FAQs where we have videos on each aspect of the program. We look forward to you using Cloud Lessons in your school.